Hi guys, I'm Davin Ogura. I'm a realtor in the LA area. And today I wanted to give you guys a market update of what's going on in the market in the Los Angeles area. Lots of people talking about recession. I haven't really seen that happen in LA yet since our inventory is so low. So I kind of want to show you what's going on right now. So let's start with a few properties in Northeast LA. Look at this one right here. These properties are under a thousand square feet, actually. 3828 Seneca Avenue. This is actually in that water village. It was listed for 1.275. It's 928 square feet and it sold for 1.461 in $600. It was only on the market for about two weeks. Let's go down to another one now. 2056 Lakeshore Avenue, that's Echo Park. It was listed at 999,000, sold for 1.3 million, 300 grand above ask, and sold at 1,336 a foot. So as you guys like my opinion about Northeast LA, it's, it's Brooklyn 10 years ago. Even though these prices may seem high to a lot of people, it's actually not because the area is still like developing and these houses are sitting in like pretty cool areas. They have a pretty cool vibe. They're like older residences with like charm, you know, features from like 1920s, 1910s. And they usually have like nice lots, you know, like nice yards, a view, character. That's important long term. So I feel like it's gonna hold its value over the next 10 years. and go up for sure. The Zada one in Northeast LA, this is an interesting one for me because it's right in between Silver Lake and Echo Park. 3309 Descanso Drive. This one is 939 square feet. It's not much smaller than some other listings that I just showed you guys. It was listed at 969, sold for 1.1. But it has a view of downtown. So a property like this, to me, a year ago probably probably would have sold at like 1.3 right so you can see that the market is adjusting a little bit but it's still going up in LA main reason for me is because of the lack of inventory also because these properties are being sold right right they either have staging or you know the the owners took good care of them they have the traditional features that these properties from like the 1900s early 1900s have and people love that right like they'll pay more for that because it's something that's hard to find now let's transition into west la a little bit of a different market more expensive right we're gonna look into mar vista area Let's look at this first property over here. So I'm looking at properties that are under 2,500 square feet in Mar Vista, which is part of West LA. 13053 Rose Avenue. This one is about 2,300 square feet. It was listed for 3.1 million, sold for 3.3. So as you see, even at a high end price point, still selling high in LA. I do have to say though, if this or in West Hollywood, you would have not sold this high. Mar Vista tends to be like a pretty hot area. But let's look at this other one over here, also in Mar Vista, 3309 Purdue Avenue. It's 2,400 square feet, was listed at 2.995, sold for 3.175. It's pretty good, right? No recession in LA, it looks like, huh? Got another one here, so 3164 Federal Avenue. This one was listed for 2.699. It's 2,000 square feet, sold for 2.925. Pretty good. As you guys can see, you know, like my whole point of this video, properties in Los Angeles, for the most part, not everywhere in LA, but for the most part, are still selling above ask, if they're being sold right. If they're staged, professional photographs, they have good agents representing the property, it's gonna sell high. Maybe not as high as it would've a year ago, but it's still selling high, prices are still appreciating. 
So I don't see any signs of recession. I guess, you know, next year will give us more of an indication, you know, if the market is gonna slow down and go down a little bit, but so far it's still going up. I hope this video was helpful for you guys. If you're looking to buy anything in LA, if you have any questions about the LA market or anything in Southern California, feel free to reach out to me. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.